Welcome to Google Finance 202. In this tutorial, you will learn how to search for stocks that match specific criteria that you want to put in place. On the home screen of Google Finance, the left column gives you links to various tools offered to find and analyze stock information. To customize your search for stocks that fit into a certain category, you'll want to use Google's Stock Screener. This is done simply by clicking the Stock Screener option on the left-hand side. The top section of your Stock Screener page is where you can input your criteria. Underneath is a list of all the companies that match those criteria. Google gives you four stock exchanges to search with, NASDAQ, the New York Stock Exchange, the American Stock Exchange, and the Archipelago Exchange. You can narrow your focus by a specific stock exchange or even a specific market sector by the sector drop-down list. Next, you can either drag the gray buttons or type your inputs into the minimum and maximum criteria boxes to specify what you want to search for. The blue graphs are visual tools that show you the overall distribution of companies over each specific setting. Let's say you want to search for companies that are valued no greater than $50 billion, have a price to earnings ratio no lower than 30, and have a positive change in price up to 100%. Google will automatically update your results listed below. As you can see, there are 122 companies that match our criteria. You can organize the list in different ways by clicking the blue headings, or if you want more information on one of your results, click the company name. Your criteria search options are customizable as well. There are over 50 search criteria that are available to use. To find these options, click the Add Criteria button. This will take you to a listed menu of options that you can add to your search settings. For instance, if you want an option to search for stocks by their trading volume, you would click the Stock Metrics option and then click Volume. You will be given a quick summary of the option. If you want it, click Add Criteria. The option will be added to your screener. To remove any screening option, just click the X on the right of each one or go back to the original format by clicking the Reset option. The next video will explain how to find and analyze trending stock and sector data. 